Hey everybody, welcome back. Don't starve. Reign of Giants. My name's Bear. We are chopping down trees and preparing for winter time. The sun's already setting. Holy cow. Okay, uh, apparently the day lasts for five seconds now. Or I just, you know, stopped in the, uh, in the, the aftermath of the daytime. Which is totally, totally expected. Uh, it's starting to snow and that makes me scared. That, that frightens me dearly. Oh, hey, look, we, uh, totally forgot to get a rabbit here as well. Set that trap. Grab that meat. There we go. Oh yeah. Okay. This is uh, this is the uh, the frightening point of the game, which we are no longer able to really wander around too much. I've gathered quite a bit of log. I've got 80 logs right now, which is a pretty decent supply. I've got a pretty full inventory here as well. We've got a uh, you know not as much stone as I'd like, but it'll do. I've actually got some manure I gotta use to fertilize some of these things up here as well. Let's go ahead and do that while that stuff's cooking. In fact, I think it just finished up. Ooh, and the pond is frozen over. Okay, I didn't even realize that would be happening, so that could, uh... Hmm. Oh, that's what she says whenever she examines that. Okay, I realize that now. Oh, it's starting to get real cold. Real cold, real fast. Alright, there we go. We got that. Got some delicious meatballs. We'll put those in the ice box. Although, you would think if we could just leave food out on the floor, it would probably be the same as preserving it inside of this thing, but, you know, whatever. Um, yeah, I think we're okay, though. Yeah, of course, we need to be focused on the fact that my, uh, my... coldness, my, my body temperature is going to be, uh, the most dangerous element of our exploration and further beyond this point. So, gotta be wary of that. Let's have a look real quick at uh, what we can make down here, actually. Carpeted flooring. I'm actually kinda curious to do that. Hold on a second, I wanna try this out. Carpeted flooring. Let's see what we can do with that. Right there. Make one of these here. Carpeted flooring, we can put that right there. Right underneath my... my tent, right? How about that? Oh wait, no, hang on. Pick that up. And we can place it. You can't do that. You can't do that. Why not? How about here? You can't do that. Um, is it because it's frozen? I don't understand this. I've never had to put down carpet before. You can't do that either. Okay, where can you do this? What if you need, like, uh, like grass? How about this? No? Alright, well, I guess that was just a waste of resources. What the hell is that for? What does that even require? I hope it didn't waste too much useful stuff. Carpeted flooring. Oh, that requires beefalo wool. Oh, shoot. Yeah, we probably shouldn't be doing that. What on earth is with this? Hold on, let's examine it. I do love woolly things. I can't, I can't say things like she does. I don't understand it. <laughs> um, I am just thoroughly confused by that, but whatever. Uh, we can make a pig house, actually. We could shelter a pig nearby. Let's do that. We've got pig skin, right? We can totally afford to do that. Where's my other pig skin? I actually need to uh, create this stack of beefalo wool here. Where's my other pig skin? There it is. That's the stuff we need. Then we need another board, right? Let's go ahead and refine a board. Let's make a pig house. That'll be fun. Structure. Pig house. Somewhere. There it is. Oh, we need four boards. Okay, we can totally do that. Two. Oh, we had 69 blogs though there. That was bad. Ruin that moment. Oh, well. Pig house time. Let's have a pig buddy nearby. It's a great idea. There you go. Home time. Hey, we made a pig friend. Perfect. Now we just gotta give him some food. Maybe a little bit of our meat supply, although I'm not really thrilled about that idea. Oh yeah, the nights are going to be long and harsh now, and I, I have a decent supply of food, but not really that great of one, so... Slightly concerned by that. I have the resources I need to wander out into the wilderness, should I so desire. Thermal stone is nice and toasty warm. I have a, uh, I have a winter, a beefalo hat, actually, that I could be utilizing right now. I don't know if I should really be wearing it all the time. In fact, while I'm near the campfire, I should probably just go ahead and put that away. Uh, let's, let's put my fishing rod in storage, because apparently I'm not going to be using that for a little while. I could probably go for another chest, actually, so let's go ahead and refine some more of these boards. I'm worried about, ch or, uh, I'm worried about using too many of these logs, like we just spent a good deal of time trying to get as many as we could, but I think, it j I think another chest is pr a uh, pretty damn good thing to have anyway, so that's fine. So we'll put these things away. Let's, uh, put away the silk for now. Put away our, what, uh, I guess we'll put away our carpeted flooring, since apparently we're not going to be able to use that anywhere. And, uh, hmm. Well, I got my golden nuggets. Maybe I should hang on to those for now. I'm already down to, oh, excuse me. <laughs> Ugh. 
bless me. Sorry about that. Um, and uh, what else? I don't think we really need to put anything else away. So I guess, I guess we're good. And here is the daytime. And here is our pig friend. Here, buddy. I have a fish. You like fish? Look, I'll give this to you. It's delicious. Better be good. Yeah, you're a picky eater, aren't you? You is good. Hey, we're friends now. Wonderful. I made friends with a pig. Perfect. All right. That that makes me feel good. I, I feel like I've done good in the world making a pig friend today. All right. What kind of magical things can we construct here? A shadow manipulator. Is this even science anymore? Hmm. What do we need for this? Oh, we need living logs, a purple gem, and nightmare fuel. A meat effigy we can make with cooked meat and beard hair. Hmm. Not a pan flute. I don't have any... Oh, I do have a pan flute already, though. Old Bell requires Glomer's wings and Glomer's flower. Oh, hello. If we killed Glomer, we can make an old bell. Hmm. That's interesting. A one-man band is possible as well, although I did just use all my pig skin to make the pig house. There's a lot of uh, interesting stuff in here. The night light doesn't help at all. The night armor needs a shadow manipulator. Dark sword also needs a shadow manipulator. There's some cool stuff here. Bat bat. That's fun. Belt of hunger keeps that belly full. Hello. Slurper pelt. Huh. Wonder what that is. A slurper pelt. Where would we find a slurper? Maybe it's time to go spelunking. Especially with my pig friend in tow. Maybe that would be a good idea. Where can I go spelunking? Let's go find a place. There's one. Yeah, let's go over there. Sure. That could be fun. Throw on our beefalo hat. Get nice and toasty warm. Grab some meat, I guess. I don't know if the rabbits are really going to be showing up anymore, but... Might as well, uh... Present the opportunity for them to be caught. I'm going to have some stale meat real fast. Oh, I'm going to go ahead and grab this too, I guess. I haven't been around here in a while, I guess. Shizzle. Alright, that'll do. I want to get down into the spelunking hole. I don't have... Well, I... Actually, I have a few torches. I've got my battle helmet and battle spear, so I'll be okay. How many reasons... Or how many torches can I make right now? I can make, like... Four. I can also make a campfire. So I'll be alright. I'll be just fine. Where's that spelunking hole? It's down over here. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. This is a good time to do it. I think. I've already been over here too, haven't I? Yeah, I can make some nightmare fuel with this stuff. Or I can get some more stone, actually. I have my hammer. Yeah, I should do this. I should do this right now. Let's take down this stone wall and get some of these things. It's only giving me like one rock, isn't it? Hmm. Is that only one rock per... Wow. That's surprising. I thought it for sure be a lot more than that. Oh well. I don't even know if this is worth the effort. Let's just go ahead and get out of here. My sanity is being drained by this place too. Alright, where is it? I think I might have passed it up. No, it's over this way. Okay. We are gonna get in there, baby. Do I have a pickaxe? I might not even have a pickaxe. Shoot. Can I hammer it? No, I can't hammer it. Alright, well, time to make a pickaxe, I guess. Can't make a golden one, so here we go. Time to get out of here. Hope I didn't have a pickaxe already. Pretty sure I didn't. Okay, sun is setting. There's my pickaxe. Come on, pig buddy. We ain't going anywhere. Let's get down. We're gonna we're gonna find a brand new place to explore. So while the cave is carved out, I suppose we need to think of our plan here. I'm, I'm going down here in uh, kind of in vain hopes of finding whatever a slurper is. Because I feel like the hunger belt would be a very, very good thing to have. I don't know whether or not it actually keeps your belly full all the time. But if it did, if it came anywhere close to doing that, I feel like that'd be more than valuable. Oh, fire is good. You're right. Okay, we're actually not uh, not that warm down here. Maybe we do need to make a fire, fire down this area. Yeah, I can make it quite a few, actually. Now I can even make a fire pit, but that's not really necessary. So let's build a campfire right by the, uh... Right by the entrance here. I'm gonna start killing some spiders, I guess. We're a little bit zoomed in. I'm gonna zoom out a bit here. I'm gonna equip this thing, and, uh... Ooh, yeah, okay. We're gonna take a little bit of damage, but... Really shouldn't be, be uh... Be too bad. Be able to take these guys out pretty easy. I don't really miss... Oh, hello! We got that thing again. I don't necessarily want my, uh, my pig buddy, what's his name, Maurice. I don't want him eating this, uh, spider meat, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep that away from him. There we go, okay. Nice, this is already a, a pretty solid find here. Take this guy out, there we go. Grab another few spider glands. I'm already out of, uh, inventory space, unfortunately, as a result of having picked up Weber's skull. And I do, I do know that I need to, uh, 
put Weber's skull in like a in a tombstone or something in order to make the most use of it. So we're gonna put the uh, thermal stone down here real fast. I'm gonna go grab the resources that I can find nearby, like this and this, for example. Maybe make a torch here as well. In fact, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Oh, I'm out of resource space again. Oh, geez. All right, tell you what, I'm gonna give the uh, I'm gonna give this morsel here to Maurice. I'm sure he'll enjoy that. And uh, then I can go ahead and cook up some of this fish here as well, actually. I just realized we can totally use this to make delicious food. So there we go. Uh, I don't necessarily need to keep the dark petals, so maybe I'll get rid of those. Add fuel to the fire here, not a big deal. And then let's have some cooked fish. Yummy. Alright, and I can actually eat the monster meat. It's not really that big of a deal. you will lose a little bit of sanity, but... Oh, well. Oh, whoops. Oh, shoot. I did not mean to eat the raw stuff. That was not a good plan. Okay, there we go. We got two cooked monster meats. We got a good supply of food. This is a level 3 spider's nest, actually. We should probably take advantage of that. Let's go ahead and put the battle helm on and get this thing uh, taken down. My god, that thing is huge. I think we might have already taken out all the spiders inside of it, though, so that'd be really nice. I think Maurice should be able to handle this problem. Eventually, this thing's going to be destroyed. We have three meats that I should probably cook up as well. There we go. That's what we needed. That's what we needed. Nice. There we go. Oh, stay away, stay away. Okay, we're good. Gonna grab this monster meat, cook that up. Good stuff. Alright, I'm gonna cook up this uh, meat here as well, because I know that's gonna go bad if I don't take care of it really quickly here. Maurice wants to have a have a nice nap real fast. I suppose can't really do much about that. Alright, carrying all I can again. I have my spider's eggs. Maybe that should be... You know what? I'm gonna go back up. I'm gonna go back up real fast. I'm gonna put these... Uh, no, I'm actually gonna put the berries down, I think. Hmm. Well, I could put down... Oh, man, I don't really want to get rid of any of this stuff. I'm gonna put the logs in the fire. Maybe that fire will still be going by the time we get back up here. Or down here, rather. I think that was a good expedition, actually. I wasn't really expecting for that to happen. But it did. Oh, goodness, it's dark. Wait a minute, why is there... I guess there's light above the spelunking hole temporarily or something? We should probably get out of here. Alright, let's go, Maurice. Over here, buddy. Getting back to the campsite. We got plenty of light. We will be just fine. In fact, I'm pl plenty warm as well. I don't necessarily have to take off my battle home yet. I'm going to try to preserve the uh, percentage health of the beefalo hat here. So I got my thermal stone. It's keeping me plenty warm. Gonna head back over this way. I think the campsite's right over here, isn't it? Oh, God. I went the wrong way. Oh, no. All right. Going back up over here. Shoot. Oh, goodness. Oh, I totally forgot about the penguins. Okay. That's going to be happening now. Luckily, my campsite is no longer uh, right adjacent to the shoreline, so... As long as I stay away from the shore, maybe they won't even show up anymore. That could be nice. If I could just avoid having the penguins spamming my battlefield. That would be really cool. Alright, we're going to make it all the way back around. I caught another rabbit, which is good. I'm carrying all I can, though. Maybe we're going to go ahead and put those berries down. We'll grab those later in the traps back set up again. Okay, that'll do. We're running low on torchlight here, but we should be able to make it back over. Is this something? That's a flower. Uh, okay. Almost there. There we go, and now we've got ourselves a nice big roasty, roasty toasty campfire. There we go. I'm gonna let this torch burn out for the sake of inventory space. And now I'm gonna put the dark flowers, dark petals in there. Uh, I'm gonna carry Weber's skull for now. I'm gonna try to make some stuff out of this meat. In fact, let's try this out. I'm gonna put, uh, one, two, three... One. We'll see what comes of that. I have another one of these, and then I will place the spider eggs down over, uh, let's put them down a little bit further away from the campsite. Let's put them down over here. Right there? That'll do it. Yeah, that'll be okay. Oh, wait, I gotta plant it. Whoops. Okay, so we'll do this, and then we'll go like that. There we go. Okay, this is, uh, this is a good thing. This is a good thing. We're gonna have a bunch more monster meat, which we can easily... Oh, God, my pig friend died. Oh. Well. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, maybe we'll get another one. And he just ate his friend, too. Wow. Alright, come on over here, buddy. I gotta... You gotta pay for what you've done. Uh, there we go, yeah. Yeah, suck on that. Give me that monster meat. Oh, God, don't do that. Don't do that. Pick up the monster meat. There we go. Grab some silk as well. Okay, that's good. That'll do the trick. Ooh, we made another monster stew, or, uh, meat stew, rather. Delicious. Ooh, a meaty stew, that'll help us out. Okay, put this away. Hopefully another pig's gonna show up for the pig house, otherwise that totally sucks. 
I'll grab this grass up here as well, might as well do that. Got this big old field of grass, might as well be making use of it. We have a lot of silk now, we've got some spider glands as well, we're gonna put those away in storage in case we need them for later on when I start to, uh, feel the effects of pain and misery. That is really dark and depressing, isn't it? Uh, let's see, where is my spider silk? I gotta keep tabs on what I've got on all these chests here, man. Alright, there's my spider silk, and I might as well keep the spider glands in here as well. Uh, we got Weber's skull, I'm gonna keep that for now. I'm gonna put the monster meat in the, uh, in the crock pot. What else could I put in there? Flowers wouldn't really do the trick. I've got a morsel. I've got some uncooked monster meats, some morsels. Hmm. Maybe I need to make more traps. Not that many traps anymore, and the rabbits are still showing up, so... It's probably a good idea. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's another one. Another trap rodent. There we are. Okay, good. That trap is done. Yeah, I think it's, uh, I think it's probably time I made some more traps. Let me grab these berries here as well. I wonder if there are still berries growing on the bushes, or maybe we, uh, lost that opportunity. I'm surprised I'm not getting, uh... Surprised I'm not that cold right now. You'd think I'd be freezing to death. The situation I'm in, but... I'm fine with it. Doesn't want to have- okay, there we go, yeah, speaking of the devil. Okay. Grab this stuff. Hey, a carrot. That's helpful. That'll do. There we are. Okay, yeah, we've got a good supply of stuff. Might be able to kill this turkey. I wonder if I can, like, back him into a corner or something. Let's try it. Let's give it a shot. See if I can take him down. Come on over, buddy. Come on over. We're gonna back you right up into this wall here. Just right on up over there. Oh, goodness. Okay, it's getting real cold. Might have to put my beefalo hat on, actually. Okay, he's in a corner now. Oh, I didn't get him. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna put my beefalo hat on. Avoid taking damage. Uh, maybe it's not that warm, actually. Hmm. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'm not actually able to kill the turkey unless I have, like, some kind of ranged weapon or something. Uh, I don't think I'm taking damage at the moment. I think I'm safe to just keep on wandering back to the campfire. We should be good. Oh, we got another rabbit. Sweet. There we are. Oh, yeah, I'm starting to feel cold. Okay, so we are, uh, all, all those traps are basically gone now. I uh, really need to get back to the camp. Already burning through all those logs really fast. Holy cow. Alright, I'm gonna go have to, uh, chop down quite a few more trees here. I know, I know, I'm freezing. It's okay. We're good. Alright, time for, uh, let's do a monster meat, a morsel, and, uh, two berries that should give me some meatballs. If I'm to be believed in my experience with cooking stuffs in this game. I'm gonna put my beefalo hat off again just to make sure I preserve that. Now we should be making a good supply of food here from what we gathered. What we gathered from, uh, this little excursion. So there's another one. I'll open this up. Let's put the carrot, the, uh, cooked monster meat, and, uh, morsel, and a berry. And then we should be able to do almost the exact same thing with the next one. Uh, meanwhile, let's go ahead and chop down a bunch of these newly planted trees that have grown into fine adult evergreens. Perfect for supplies. Good, good, good. This will be fantastic. Yeah, we got a good campsite going, man. We got a good, uh, base of operations here. I really like this. Feeling really confident. Uh, of course, uh, once a giant shows up again and destroys my entire life, I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna feel so good about it, but... For now... For now, at least, I get to be happy to a certain degree, right? I better go find a graveyard again, actually. In fact, where's the nearest tombstone? I should probably just go take care of Weber's skull right away. So I do have a shovel, right? Yeah, I do. I have a regal shovel, in fact. A very, very nice shovel. I'm gonna dig up some of these stumps here as well. Make sure I'm capitalizing on all the resources available to me right here. Should probably go cook something up again as soon as I chop down this tree. Uh, we'll probably just, uh, make a big roaring fire and try to chop down all these trees while we cook some stuff up for the nightfall. Uh, and then, uh, the, uh, the start of day 25, maybe we'll try to run on down and resurrect Weber. Alright, so there's that. Another morsel. Might have to use two of my, uh, two of my monster meats in this one. I might make a monster lasagna, but I'm okay with that, actually. That's everything I had left, so... That'll do. That'll do. Alright, let's, uh, throw... let's go with, like, three. That should make a big one. Okay, yeah, there's monster lasagna, which is fine. I might just eat that right now. I'm gonna put these meatballs in the ice box. There we are. Lots of food ready and waiting for me in there. That is super handy. Yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling like I, uh, I kind of finally have a handle on things. 
I've got a lot of food. I've got a good supply of resources around the, uh, around the campsite here. I've got a battle helm, a battle spear, a beefalo hat, plenty of beefalo wool in case I need to make another one. Lots of, uh, lots of renewable stuff. Some berries, uh, for later on in the, in the event of needing more foodstuffs. My sanity is plummeting right now for some reason. I think it's most likely because I'm venturing so far away from the fireplace. Yeah, wow, that big fat arrow. It's trying to tell me something and I'm not listening to it. Do I have garland left? I don't. Oh boy, this is bad. Okay, hold on a second. Let's, uh, tell you what. It might be sleeping in the, in the tent time, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna dig up some more stumps, and, uh, hopefully that time will be well spent. I need to, I really need to regain some of this sanity, man. This is actually really bad. Not good to be that low, so I will sleep for the last little bit of the evening, or the night, rather. I will eat upon the morrow, and I will be good to go, right? I think so. The curtain falls. Okay, she doesn't like being out here. Oh, boy. Oh, oh God, okay, yep. We're good. We're good. Okay. We're gonna... We're gonna sleep now. Yeah. Good night. <laughs> oh, God. All right, let's have some monster lasagna. That's okay. And we'll grab, uh, I tell you what, we'll have, uh... No, we're not gonna eat a meat stew. We're gonna have a meatball. Okay! That's good! That's good, that's good. Use the resources there, man. Let's plant all these pine cones, then we'll say sayonara for this episode of Don't Starve, Reign of Giants. So like I said, man, we got a good thing going here, and I think, uh... As long as I can manage to plant pine cones, first of all. I think as long as I, uh... Pay heed to the, uh... To the needs I have, as long as I maintain a good supply of resources on my person at all times, just make sure I don't, you know... Let myself, uh, go astray without... Without the resources with which to make fire or food or whatnot. I should be just fine here, man. I think I am, uh... I'm ready to... face the... the next season, maybe, even. Find out how far we can go next time here. Don't starve, Rain of Giants. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.